Do you like what you see? Would you hang this in your living room? Care to know who created these pieces? Here they are. These students at the Robert D. Steedham Education Center are making art of this caliber. And this is their canvas. At the start of the school year, these students enrolled in this graphic design class. Most had no idea what they were getting into. Like at first, I didn't really I was interested in the class. Like a couple of things we did, like from Photoshop to like the Bryce, like kind of caught my eye. When we first started off, it was like something kind of flat, and I'm like, is this really graphics? Really? I really enjoy it. Uh, I, I actually didn't know what it was when I first signed up for it, and I. Now I wanted to be a field that I go into in college. They start small using Apple Works to sketch lines. Next comes working with other programs like Photoshop. Currently, students are working with a program that creates three-dimensional art. They create anything from CD covers to portraits to... African mask and uh, after we went through and we got explained what each thing represents like Beards represent old age, uh, thin eyes represent power. You just, I just kind of formed it up. It's my surrealism, which is something that's a dream, fantasy, nightmare. Um, I named this one Paradise. You would take like your picture or just basically just something simple and you just make it massive. It's an amazing um, transition from the beginning to now and um, our students have really come to the task. They've, they've produced um, much more than I even expected them. This is a pilot program that was brought into Charles County Public Schools by this man, James Lippiano. He ran a similar program in Prince George's County that started off at Bowie High School. It is now in every high school in Prince George's County. Some of Mr. Lippiano's former students got jobs right out of high school with such companies as Disney and Pixar. He believes the program will also succeed in Charles County Public Schools. Along the way they learned the principles of design. They also learned a lot of art appreciation and uh, integrated it really well with a lot of their other academics. The possibilities are just limitless with the graphic design. These aspiring artists are already receiving orders for their work. They are designing a logo for an energy company and creating a DVD cover that will be distributed nationally. Several county agencies have also asked for these students' services. The class is evolving from course to career training. Actually, I'm hoping to uh, use the graphic design course and field to uh, move into animation and uh, start working on that. One thing I love to do is t-shirts. I love funny t-shirts, you know, just like the one I'm wearing now, old t-shirts of TV shows I used to grow up watching. Um, that's something that I want to do, not, if not for a career, just something on the side is just, you know, just make funny t-shirts. The class, though, it just helped me out in a lot of ways because of, um, like, I was big enough when I was growing up and I just faded out and just coming back to this class has just made me get back into it, enjoy it more, know what I can do more with it.